So I wrote a song about quarantine. Quarantine's been really hard for a lot of people, and I'm sure you guys can all relate. But I wrote this song, and I hope you guys can sing along, because it's, it's pretty easy. <laughs> Today, we are making a bulk chicken pot pie. It's gonna be easy, because I have all my frozen vegetables. I have celery, onion, carrots, and I also have like cloves of garlic that's already like cut up and ready to go. Um, I've got three whole potatoes and um, I'm using this. I know that this is um, not usual, but because I'm kind of in a hurry, um, this is just gonna save us a little bit of time. And I'm telling you, you're not gonna be able to tell the difference between like chicken breast and canned chicken. A lot of cans of chicken because I was preparing for the end of the world when all of this happened with coronavirus. So um, I wound up losing my mind and buying all kinds of like potted meat. So I've got, like I bought Spam. I've never had Spam before in my life. Um, but I bought Spam. I bought um, Vienna sausages, which I've also never had in my life. Um, and then I also got like these things of chicken. Usually I use this when I'm making buffalo chicken dip um, because it's just, it's so much easier than, you know, having to cook a bunch of chicken breasts and all that. So anyway, I am in the middle of dicing up my potatoes. And like I said, I do have, this is all stuff that I had frozen. So I've got celery, onions and carrots, and I'll be dicing those all up and Hold please. So you're gonna saute um, three potatoes, two onions, and about, I don't know, like three carrots along with butter and garlic, about two cloves of garlic I think I threw in here, somewhere in there. So you're gonna saute that. Now all of my veggies saute, I wanna show you what I just made. I made a couple of casseroles, um, Mexican casseroles. So I made Spanish rice last week um, I used the exact same recipe for this, uh, for the rice, but I did add, um, in with it, some of this stuff. Um, I mentioned earlier that I'm using this for another recipe. I bought a bunch of them the other day, um, when I was like out shopping because I, we're starting to go through all of our potted meat. So I bought a little bit of extra, um, but I wanted you to know that I, um, did the salsa, green pepper, onion. Um, I added some cumin, um, and then I added a bunch of salsa. But I layered that with tortilla shells, with cheese, with more salsa, and just kept repeating it like I was making a lasagna. So there's that. So all of that is sauteed. I'm gonna throw in, this is a can each of peas and corn. Um, I'm also going to throw this in. Um, my, I have three of these big cans of chicken, and um, after that, I'm going to add um, about eight or nine tablespoons of flour, and then we'll add chicken broth in. Okay, so I added the flour in, um, and I'm also going to go ahead and add about three tablespoons of parsley. We're going to add some black pepper. And we're also gonna add a little bit of salt. And then we're gonna add our broth. So I added about um, four cups of chicken broth into this and I did the taste test. I had my husband do the taste test. We agreed that we added some onion powder to it and a little bit more pepper. Um, just, to, you know, uh, add whatever you want as far as seasonings go to soup. I'm gonna put them all in these aluminum pans because these are going in my freezer. I'm gonna be having surgery in the next week and I want my babysitter to be able to like just grab something and throw it in the oven. So that'll work. So I used the um, frozen refrigerated crust. This one was still like fully frozen. That's why it's all like broken apart. But I decided to um, warm this one up a little bit and it came out a little bit better. But let's look at what we've got for the day. All right, so this is what we've got. We've got two unstuffed kind of um, chicken pot pies and we've got two like Mexican lasagnas. And it took me, how long did it take? I don't know, an hour and a half. An hour and a half and this is my kitchen witch. And he is the one that, he's the, the throw, stop it. He's the one that throws away all the things. 
he's the one that cleans up after me because I make a mess. Yeah. So anyway, that's what we made this morning. So I've got enough for this week. I've got enough for next week when it's in my freezer. Um, I feel very accomplished today. And damn, homegirl looking good. I have them all labeled and covered with tin foil, and then I'm gonna cover it with um, plastic wrap. Something that I forgot to mention was I added about a cup of heavy cream into the chicken pot pie toward the end. I can't believe I forgot to tell you that, but otherwise we are good to go for the freezer.